Oh my. Look what the cat dragged in now. Fresh meat. A 93 Buick Century. Leave my gate open for a moment and look what shows up. Well, I kind of expected I heard it was coming. Now I gotta walk 800 feet to go get it. That sucks. Well, looks like Wolf's Home's coming down now. From whence I came, Buick is the name. Wow, looks pretty good. Too bad it has to die. Oh well. The only thing I heard wrong with it was it had a bad alternator. But I got one of those, that's not a problem. Not too bad. Wow, clean like new. With random teddy bear. Sweet, loaded. Even smells like new. Cool. I even got a note. Oh, my cats would just love you on a string, wouldn't they? Oh, what's this? Beer is all you need? Yeah, I agree. Well, anyways, me and Jesus will have a beer together one day when I get there. Maybe he agrees too. Ah, oh, it's got one of those damn 4,000 RPM redline things. That sucks. Oop, voltage is low. We better get back to the barn quick. Before she dies. Oh, 332,000 kilometers. Drives great. Now I guess it's time to change the alternator. Totally smooth, perfect steering. Look, Mom, no hands. Brakes work. Good, good brakes. Wow, I don't even have to fix brake lines, fuel lines, and redneck gas tank. It's a sweet car. Gotta love your Buicks. Alrighty, let's go find an alternator. 3.8 I assume. That's the baby. I think this is the one that has over 200 horsepower. That's good. Oh, I'm wrong. It's a 94. That's even better. 95? Hell, we're moving up in the world. Well, there's my alternator that I took from my 92 Buick Regal last year that I crushed with my dozer and blew the motor on and everything else. I think it should take the place of where that littler, more modern one is. Probably fits. Probably a simple job, just a one beer job. Got the battery on charge, so we're guaranteed success. So, let's get her done. Wow, only 1.5 gulps later. And three minutes, and she's already off. Sweet. Next. Well, only 2.4 swigs of beer later, and we're ready to party. Let's fire her up and check the voltage. Oh, gotta be like the cleanest car we ever had out here. It's Teddy approved. Right, Care Bear? Uh oh. It wasn't the alternator? Don't tell me we got a wiring problem I'll have to diagnose. That's not a problem. Darn it! Well, first thing we gotta do is check if there's power going to the little plug-in terminal that went on the side of the alternator. She's working good now, but I don't think the gauge in the dashboard is correct. Very strange. Anyways, I know she's working, so we don't have a problem. Time to go for a ride. Well, fix the gauge now. 
show you what it was. The main B plus terminal was loose, and that wire was really hot and still hot. I just tightened it. Now it's perfect, and the headlights are bright. All right, first test. Ooh, cool. Oh well, that one works. Two out of four ain't bad. It's a Buick, you know. Wow, this thing is such a nice, comfy automobile. I feel so regal driving around in something like this. Excuse me, do you have any great poupon? <laughs> Catch me now! Oh, just like a new car! Not for long. Well, we made it to the beach. No women because it's a Friday. Just a couple ship machines. <laughs> and another one. Oh, we got no mud this weekend. It dried up. Holy crap. To think of other ways to have fun. such a shame now we have to destroy cars that were far better than the ones that I drove when I was young. Wow, even better than my white old diesel van. Wow, we've got so many free cars lately. We haven't had a chance to get these ones out. We've just been too busy with all the other ones. But they're all fine. Yeah, we got to take that up Sky Hill too. And the tradesman van. still too quiet. Doesn't feel like it should be on the farm. We'll soon fix that. Gotta kill those cars too soon. They're still running, but it's time for them to die. Getting a bit shabby for out here. We like these uh, sweet, clean cars, you know. My little old lady on Sundays just to go see him. Tabletop anyone? So you'll just have to wait. Hasn't been a good year for driving in the forest trails. We've had so many heavy rains. This is the first time, first time I've been back here with a car. You would just get stuck. But it actually hasn't rained for almost seven days. That's amazing for this year. Starting off just like last year. I gotta get my tractor back here and cut the grass. Even though I cut it last Friday, it's only been a week. I'm always wondering when I'm going to find a body back here. At least not one I got rid of, you know, a different one. <laughs> Here's those cars from another view. Definitely got a Sky Hill U this weekend. It's just too quiet. I wonder why people get rid of cars like this. 
people in the states would still drive something that had a little bit of rust and was 1994, but not in Canada. Not too many people would drive something this old. They just give them away. Well, any Grey Poupon yet? Nice mod. Back safe. Radio works. What more can you ask for?